You know, I half expected when I Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is! What? So yeah, I'll just sit in here to talk to you guys for a second. <laughs> Where the tyrant can't be physically closing in on me. Where what? We're in the east wing now, so I want to go back north real quick. Because there is a document on the wall of the save room over north that I missed. So, sorry about that, but... I mean, I saw it while editing, and I'm like, oh my god, this is gonna infuriate people that I walked by that, like, three times and didn't see it. So we're gonna go there, we're gonna read the note, and then we're gonna go west, okay? Okay? Sound good? And we're gonna try not to die in the process, because I haven't played this game in a long- Oh shit. Long time. Wait. This is correct. Okay, good. So we're gonna head- It is north. Okay. They won't listen if they're not afraid. These are long, like, narrow catwalks. If he catches me on one side, boy. Okay, here it is. <clears throat> ID wristbands. This research facility uses the latest security technology in order to ensure employee safety and efficient business practices. Oh. I remember this. When I went through this area the first time and I lost footage, yay, we're bringing that back up again, I found this. And I guess I just forgot about it when I went back to play through it again. Whoops. So, okay, I have read this before. In order to enter and exit the facility and to operate certain equipment, employees must use an ID wristband. There are three levels of access, visitor, general staff, and senior staff. Okay, we know this already. Authentication is granted based on an electronic chip inside the wristband. This, the wristband access level can be changed by simply inserting a different electronic chip. Visitor wristbands can be given to family members of employees. Please inquire at reception for further details. Okay, so I did find that in the past and then forgot about it when I played through it again. But we have it now, so it's fine. Yep, I've cleared everything. Okay, so we can just head west. Let's go. Before big, angry, beefy android man shows up. <clears throat> Loosening up a bunch of shit in my throat. I just woke up. Sorry. But it's 9 a.m. I got up at 8.15, <laughs> so I've been up for less than an hour, and I'm jumping into a horror game because I hate myself. Um... Oh god. You know, loud is good for a horror game, but this is just too loud. Like, it's actually hurting my ears. Okay, there we go. Hopefully the G-sample's up here. Oh, hopefully? <laughs> I don't know about hopefully. But, uh... Damn it, you wiped my memory. I was gonna say something and then I forgot. Right. Uh... Brian and Amelia are streaming at noon again today, so I'm recording at 9 so I can get three hours in before they start. Because, uh, they've been traveling. Oh, that's not good. They've been traveling for a while now, and skipped last weekend, so I want to watch them, because I miss them. Oh, that's gonna be good. Operation Nest Wrecker. Oh. Oh. It says one, though. Hold on. God, I'm playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I'm playing Assassin's Creed Remastered. I'm playing this. My controls are all over the damn place. At least they're all on the same system. But, bruh. It doesn't... It, yeah, it says one. What did the other one say? Did it say two? So is this what happened before? Oh, and I'm injured. That's probably good to note. That's a grenade. <laughs> I'm gonna kill myself with that. Okay, wait, hold on. I have three. Sure, I'll take that. Okay. <clears throat> How many knives do I have? Oh my god, another one? Oh, but it's right there next to a chest. Okay, thank you for having mercy on me. Thank you. Uh, where did it go? There it is. Now what do I need to set it to? OSS. Okay. I don't know where the tyrant went, but he's gonna show up at some point to scare the shit out of me again. Okay. <laughs> oh no, other way. There we go. Got it! And put you in! <laughs> that was that a mistake? I feel like that was in such a convenient place. I, I'm worried that that's gonna bat oh. Oh, that's not good. 
That's not good. Is this where they tested it on people? Is there a say? Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, I don't need that anymore. Oh, I can't start from here. Oh, well. I'll do it in a sec. Here we go. Okay, I'm just a muted capture. I muted my monitor. Wait, is that is that Mr. Dr. Birkin? Oh no. That was cool. Dr. Birkin, you'll come along with us quietly. You think I didn't know you were coming? This is my life's work. I'm not handing over anything. We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time. <laughs> That's called a suicide. What the fuck were you thinking? Our orders were to bring him in alive. It's not like you guys were decked out in armor or anything. We're in, sir. But we had a snafu. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Is Redfield one of these guys? Roger that. Just the samples, then. Let's move. So those were G-samples. Oh my god, I think I just had an epiphany. Also, I don't remember the frame rate in this game being this good, because hot damn. But, uh, first let me discard this. Bye, it was fun. Bye, bye, bye. Okay, so that was, that must have been before the other one. When the, when the virus samples broke and the rats ate it and that's how the virus got out, right? I wish I still- wait, do I? I don't still have the other tape, do I? I do. Is that it? Oh my god, I kept it. Can I watch it again? <gasps> okay. Yeah, this is number two. Okay, so that was definitely before. And then- and then this happens. Oh, please, stop. That's his briefcase. <laughs> this is Kirkpatrick, the other one was Martinez. No, 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 no. Oh, you freak! Don't hurt him. Okay. I don't want to say it in case I'm, like, wildly wrong, but I'm going to say it in case I'm right. I think that that thing that's come back and tried to kill me twice now I think that's Mr. Birkin. He's dead. We watched him get shot and killed in the thing. So he died and came back. I don't know why he's mutating and the other zombies aren't. I think I'm onto something. Okay, so is this his office? Jane Doyle. Suspending research on G, the Umbrella Corporation has decided to cease all research on G, which was ongoing at the Nest Underground Laboratory. All funding for this project has been- I like how you're mentioning underground laboratories and emails. <laughs> Just saying. All funding for this project has been cut, and Laboratory Director William Birkin, okay, has been removed from his post. Oh, shit! He was- okay, so he was the lab director. B.E. Who's B.E.? Thank you for your mail, Dr. Birkin. Top Brass has expected an interest, expressed an interest in this evolving bioweapon you mentioned. Do not worry about costs. Our company is the most well-funded in the whole of the United States. Oh, God. It's Abstergo. Richard Kessler. Congratulations. I've heard the good news. G is almost ready. Strange you never thought to report to the research lab here at Umbrella HQ, but I suppose I can let that slide. Anyway, send over the data, would you? And don't worry, you've done good work on G, but we can take care of the rest. Jane Doyle, 
You are under suspicion of breaching your contract with the Umbrella Corporation. It has become clear that you have claimed ownership of the G Project and have been in unauthorized access with the U.S. or contact, excuse me, with the U.S. military. Please respond to the investigation committee summons within 24 hours. What were you doing, Jane? Hmm. That is definitely interesting. Okay. But there's no save station here that worries me. I have, like, no ammo. <laughs> okay, hold on. Um, I also only have one healing spray. Uh, I could use more shotgun shells, I guess. So I'll take this, and then take a large, sure, and then combine them. Okay. That'll do it for now. Okay, shotgun is down. <laughs> I need to get used to where everything is now. Oh, this is not gonna go well. I'm, like, I'm feeling a cutscene, and I'm... Uh, oh, I don't like that. That reminds me of... Is it the end of chapter 13 in Dead Space 2? <laughs> Those of you who played the game know what I'm talking about. Cross your heart and hope to die. <clears throat> I won't say anymore. I'm, I'm, I still very much plan to replay that game for you guys. I also have to replay Revelations. Like, uh, got so much shit to do here. Okay, I've cleared this room. Ugh, I'm just gonna put these purple herbs away. Oh wait, no, not that. I have never used these. Remove toxins from your body. I don't know what that means. But until I do, I ain't using it. Could you really not just put a typewriter there? Come on now. Oh, uh, that's not good. Uh, maybe you should put one of them on, Leon? Just saying. Oh. Well, that's convenient. Did I carry that around with me? I just made I just made more ammo. Oh, go put that back. <laughs> if I need to make more ammo next time I bump into one of these chest things, I will. I also don't like how the tyrant just seemingly gave up on me. Like, I heard it at the beginning of the session, and what is it, just not leaving the east wing, or what? It's a little too easy to dodge him this time. Oh, whoa, that's fancy. <sighs> I'm all wet. <laughs> oh, I'm not wet no more. I was gonna make a joke. <laughs> Maybe that's for the best. <sighs> drying clothes on. Jacket drying. Beep. Your jacket is now dry. <laughs> Back to the future part two, anyone? This. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. It's like the inside of a PC rig. Oh my god. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, what is this? Yeah, the big eyeballs that that guy's got on him, like... Oh, this is not good. What am I going to interact with that's going to trigger something? Wait, what? P4 level testing lab. <clears throat> oh, hello! I'll hang on to that. Oh, okay, you put a typewriter in here. Why do I think I'm not safe still? <laughs> Should I combine these now or save them? I'll save it. I'll, I just use the large gunpowder. I'll save it. And save. I still have my backup save from when I was worried. You know what? Maybe I should have uh, done that for uh, this session. Too late now. Okay. I suppose it's not. I haven't really missed much. But I did, I did destroy both of the tapes, so I wouldn't be able to play them again. Oh, this is gonna be good. Also, oh, that's the umbrella logo. I know that. Embryo growth observation subject four. Shut up! I'm uploading a video. I'm aware. 
Get, stop it, I don't care. Subject 449, after the G embryo was implanted in the subject, we made a 50 centimeter incision from the chest to the abdomen and began our observations. Oh, and they watched how it like affected the inside. Oh, that's creepy. With the help of the medical team, the subject's consciousness level was kept between 15, lucid, GCS 10. I don't know what that means. <laughs> However, the subject's consciousness level deteriorated and further observation was deemed unnecessary. The subject was disposed of. Breeding rate, oh god. Subject 501. Different subject. Several subjects later, I'm assuming. Oh god. The G virus was administered to subject 501. 501 mutated into G form and was introduced to a group of 30 test subjects. 30. After two hours, 36 minutes, it was observed that all but one of the test subjects had been implanted with an embryo. All subjects were disposed of. One subject broke down during experimentation and took their own life. T-virus, resistance experimentation. What's a T-virus? Subject 628 and 639. We have administered the G-virus to subject 628, who had shown slight resistance to the T-virus. The virus was then introduced to subject 639, with whom 628 had a close relationship. Oh, come on. 628 showed some signs of resistance, but had been implanted with an embryo after 24 minutes. T-virus resistance does nothing to stop the mental deterioration caused by the G. The fuck? Why would you ever think experiments like that are a good idea? Uh. Oh, boy. Huh. That was easy. Oh, God, don't. You jinxed it. All right. Now back to Ada. Attention. <sighs> Unauthorized removal of a level 4 virus detected. The facility lockdown can Oh god, I gotta go. Oh, I gotta go. I gotta go right now. And this big, like, wide area in the middle of this catwalk is gonna be for me to do the tyrant! Or that guy! Or that guy! Oh, it's him! Look at him! That's him! Tell me you weren't involved in this. Yes. But we never meant for this to happen. What, the virus you're working on breaking tell me out? Everything. Right from the start. Fucking shocking. Um, I mean it's on we're lockdown, self-destruct, all that crap. Give away that is. Can we talk about this after we go? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, you didn't die. Good God, William. What have you done? So you made this monster. We made the G-Virus, but we never intended this- You can spin it any way you want. Um, You're still responsible. <laughs>
Oh, not good. This is not good. Oh, that's gonna suck. <laughs> How am I supposed to dodge that? Well, guys, here we go. First death of the series. Here we go. Here we fucking go. What? Oh god, one hit and I'm down to danger again. Yep, this is it, every whoops. This is it, everybody. Leon's going down in the blaze of glory! What the fuck is all this? Uh oh, maybe I should be using that. Well, I'm cornered! Hold on, give me that. Uh ugh, fuck. I don't know how I'm supposed to dodge this! No! <sighs> And I finally died. Shut up, dog. I'm trying. He moves so much and I'm panicking. <laughs> Placing checkpoints to difficult fights on the other side of a cutscene. It's dumb and I don't like it. Oh, shit! Ouchies. He, like, goosed my ass there. Oh, God! Too close. You're too close, sir. You're a little too close, sir! I'm in right now. He, 
I'm surprised I'm still alive. I know! Give me a second. Okay.